Hey folks, Taylor here from OpenFN. Uh, I want to tell you about the job library. So uh, we've had the OpenFN user community volunteer to share the jobs they're writing and running on the OpenFN platform um, with the, the rest of the world, basically. So most of the folks who use OpenFN keep their job code in public repos to begin with, but we've built an API that makes it possible to read all of the publicly shared jobs on OpenFN and uh, parse them, figure out what, what kinds of things they're doing, what adapters they're using, what functions they're using. And the hope is that this library will make writing new jobs much faster and easier. Um, so if, when you click into the library, you'll see that right now they're clustered by the adapter they're using. If we go to the DHIS2 adapter, um, you'll see here's an example being pulled from uh, the OpenFN job library. And we get a little information on uh, you know, what adapter, what adapter version is being used. Even a score, which helps you understand whether or not this job is likely to be helpful. Um, we can't expose any sensitive information, uh, like data and runs or messages, of course. Um, but uh, based on a number of factors and sort of job metadata, we can get a sense of whether or not this is a good example to look at. Um, so this is really cool, uh, and you can search for the different functions that are used here, so, so you learn how to use them yourself. You can copy this code and, and paste it into your own, um, into your own job expressions. Um, and two things uh, to note here. One, if you see a little sparkle next to one of these jobs, um, that means uh, it has a very high score. So we think it's probably a good example submitted by someone in the community. And if you see a scroll here, that means it's actually an official example from OpenFN. Um, so for some of the more complex things we're doing here, like you know, timeouts to create delays and using async and array.map, um, those will actually be examples submitted by the OpenFN team, uh, and, and we, think they're, uh, we think they're really nice examples for you all to learn from. So uh, head on over to the OpenFN job library, look for sparkles, look for scrolls, uh, and if you're using OpenFN, um, definitely consider sharing some of your job code so that the rest of the community can benefit from it. All right, thanks very much. Bye.